This is going too far. Water? How do you get so disgusted by drinking water? Wait, what? Mm. Oh, it's about Esmond. <laughs> Is that Fiji water? Chat, to be honest, Fiji water tastes weird. Fiji water tastes fucking weird. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Who the fuck drinks this shit? <laughs> yeah, I just. Uh. Mm. The green Fiji water, so yeah, I mean, Fiji water is really weird. It has a really off taste. Anyway, so 41,000 likes, 4 million views. <gasps> yeah. Grown ass hating on someone for drinking guys, water on stream. <laughs> I really hate to tell you guys this. There, there's quotes with over 100k likes. What? I really hate to tell. I, I, I hate to do this because it's like it, it does, kind of. <laughs> so I'm drinking anything that is. That was a frick toast for the first time in drinking 20 years. Drinking anything that is. <laughs> 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 Perfect. Perfect. Oh god. This is of course why I hate water. That's his room. This fresh neutral water allowed in the By the way, by the way, chat, do you know why warm or like room temperature water tastes so much worse than cold water? You wanna know? You wanna know a fun fact, chat? Do you know why? Chlorine? No, 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 no. Cold water tastes so much better because the coldness numbs your tasting buds. You don't taste how shit water actually tastes. Water always tastes like shit. That's why. <laughs> Just letting you know. Just letting you know. I still drink cold water. Like, I still drink cold water, but that's a fun fact for you. That's a fun fact for you, Chad. Taste the bacteria in his own mouth for once. His breath is probably rancid. Oh. This silly girl. This is not true. I don't have bad breath. I, um, I don't. So, the reason why I don't have bad breath is I don't have any teeth. So... Honestly? He's right. He can't really have bad teeth if he doesn't have any- <laughs> Bad breath if he doesn't have any fucking teeth. <laughs> I honestly believe it. Like, I honestly believe that he doesn't have bad breath. <laughs> How could I have bad breath? I don't. I don't. I genuinely do not. Ask anybody that's talked to me, I do not have bad breath. I don't. It's good. I don't have any teeth. Yeah. And so, like, I do have, and also, um. Yeah. Scratch, uh, scratch, scratch. I mean. Duncan Rod and that can stink. I mean, okay, but there has to be a reason for it rotting first. Should I. I thought a lot of the bad breath bacteria were on your tongue, and pretty sure he has a tongue. But the 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 bre uh, the the bacteria is gonna come from somewhere first too. But he brushes his teeth regularly. Yeah, he does brush his teeth. He does brush his fake teeth. That is true. I, I guess. Pretty sure he got teeth. He has fake teeth. He has six real teeth left, and that's the one in the front. He has six real teeth left, and that's the one in the front. I know my Aspen lore. <laughs> Puro space. Thanks for the follow. I'll just say it. I'll say it because it makes things more exciting. <laughs> Every day inside of like my uh, teeth, mm -hmm. I will take my toothbrush and floss and I will push mm -hmm. uh, food out from like in between like flossing basically. Yeah. Right? Get the food out. Yeah. And I will then get the food out every day. 
and uh, in doing so, I will sometimes smell it, and it will smell literally like death. It will smell like dead, dead. I mean, <laughs> I, that 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 just happens when you leave the tea, the the food between the teeth. If if you leave it there for too long, that 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 is what happens. Ew. That food, and um, because I was starting to drink things and i kept tasting literal death mm. and uh Ew. i was like well what is this isn't normal and so i started uh it doesn't if you do it every day yes but that's he didn't do that before <laughs> he didn't do that before now he does brushing my teeth more and 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 drinking more water and making sure that i clean my teeth better so this would happen so she's right no she wasn't because I stopped letting that happen. It happened for a few days. That was it. Yeah. And so it's like water floss. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And so um, anyway, uh, I hate to tell you guys this. I really do. But inside of this stream here, I was planting a plant. And... It was a plant that the uh, oh, developers oh. of Elden Ring, the yeah, publisher the of Elden, Elden Ring, Ring, sent me. Yeah, 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 I remember! I remember! Did I watch the stream or did I watch the video of it? I think I watched it live. And I had the Fiji water, and to, to water I the watered plant. the plant from Elden Ring with Fiji water because I thought it would give it a better chance. <laughs> I really hate to break the fourth wall, but when I do stuff like this, I'm farming. Of course he is. Like, come on! Lay. Like... <laughs> How is that obvious? What the fuck? I am. I'm farming. Like, of course he is! Like, any good streamer farms like that! Like, uh, bro! That... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. And it works. It works on such a massive level, <gasps> it is unbelievable. It's crazy. My world is shattered. I know, I know, I know. <gasps> and there's three things of A1 there. Ow. You tell me you play a character? No, I don't really play a character. I just play no, things up every once in a while because I think it'll things. That's exaggeration. It'll be oh funny. My God. I think people will react to it in a funny it's like, way. Yeah, it's like It's like being a class clown, you know? You you're trying to entertain people. Like I, I don't really fake things in a way. I just play things up a little bit. Like I like the the taste of water more than or t taste of soda more than water. So I was like, oh, I think this would be funny if I did this, right? Yeah, it's exaggeration. Yeah, I'll I'll, I'll just I'll put on a show. I, I I like entertaining the audience. We live in an age that content farming is an actual job. I mean, yeah, it's entertainment, bro. It's entertainment. It's always been. This existed since before, at least. The Middle Ages. Maybe even before the Middle Ages. You you guys know like the clowns per, pe person that people hired? The rich people hired? I, I, I don't know what it's called in English. I don't even remember the German word for it, man. Jester! Yes! The Jester! It existed for hundreds of years, man! I do. I think it's very funny. And uh, it's clearly made a joke. Yeah, it is. And um, I, I find that there's like a, a huge issue... And I think this has happened with COVID where a lot of people on social media have, I think that, I don't know if it's like a, like a, a, like arrested development or some form of like kind of social, like, like, a, like lack of formation, right? Where it's like people don't like, yeah. Something that's what? like obviously satire, uh, people are getting like mad about it, or like oh, they're like thinking about this. Like oh, it, it's there's oh, like a, this like a social oh, okay. inhibition. Yeah, like what okay. what is this? Like I I don't know how yeah, it happens. People are taking I see it all shit the at face value and taking it way too fucking serious when it's bro just a joke, bro it's just a fucking joke. Like this is the same thing. Yo, 
in regards to Fillion, where people are still calling Fillion a racist because she made a joke. When she was saying, uh, people were saying like, you're breathtaking, no, you're breathtaking, you know, like, first the freaking um, Keanu Reeves line, you're breathtaking, and then she says uh, something about George Floyd, and then she's like, oh shit, was that too actually sorry, my bad. Like, and people are calling her racist for that, man. Like, shut up. It was a stupid, edgy joke. Don't take everything so literal and so fucking serious. My God. Bro, chill. They plan to it, but they don't see through the joke? Yeah. I'd, a Asperger? Yeah, I don't know. Because, like, there's plenty of things that I'm... They were so rich about that. Yes, they do. Zero teeth. It's not they satire at this point. It's irony poisoning. Well, so this is the best part about it. And this is, I think the best type of satire is the satire that's halfway true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's the stuff that when it's, it, it's not completely true because it makes it believable, right? Because mm. that makes it exciting. And so it's like, yeah, maybe this is true. Maybe it is bad. But is it, it makes you do a double take. Yeah, exactly. Twitter it's over. People, yeah, yeah, brand salt. Yeah, and, and that's, people, that's the way I see it. Believable absurdity. Yes. From the haters. Asmon derangement syndrome. Well, I know, I, I know. And I, I, I love is. being a, uh, I love being a character. The water thing wasn't even the worst thing of what you said. And ironically, I don't even remember what I said in this. What do they even say? <gasps> Oh, people drank this shit? Oh, yeah. That's better. That's better. Ah, that's better. That's better. That's better. Wow. Yeah. Who the fuck drinks this shit? <laughs> yeah, it's just... Uh, it's just like everything... The Fiji water, the sip of... Co yeah, everything about this. And, like, ev <sighs> and I think that this is... The, yeah, and, and it wouldn't be funny if everybody would know for a fact that it was a joke, right? And that's what makes stuff like this funny, is that I do things that are... I'll try to do things that are ridiculous, but I'm ridiculous. But, uh, yeah. So... <laughs> but facial expression is Maybe funny. it's yeah. not a joke, right? And so maybe you, you actually live inside of like this weird... Maybe it actually half hates half. water. And I think that's what makes it... I'm coping so hard. What am I coping with? <laughs> Barrier and entry. Yeah, no, He's I, coping. I'm very confused here. He actually hates water. He's not actually farming the haters. Yeah, uh, shorting your hobo. Exactly. And, and, and so you... You, you you play into this kind of stuff. Yeah, you... It's what makes it funny to me. Yes. <laughs> Put people posting and farming because it works. It does. And I, I, I love being... It, it's been astonishing to me that there are so many people on the internet that are just thinking about me, talking about me, like making posts about me, like He's reposting clips about me, like talking about like all the other things that they know about me. Like, I... I, I this... it It's really... <laughs> Honestly... <laughs> He's an enigma. It, 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 I never expected it to go this far. I, I, I never did. Who really did. does? And it's happened about this. People think about me every day. You're I don't know about what me. you're talking you're about. Like, about. Things that I said, things that I did. And I saw a satire who purposely boring the lines between real and fake to make it funnier. I think it's undeniable that it could be misunderstandably taken the wrong way. I don't know. I think it's obvious, but I guess not. So... Oh, well, people get upset and hand you. Yeah, it, it it's just, it's like a social experiment, I guess so. And it's a social experiment. It, 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 it is obvious. <laughs> I I think it's obvious, right? I do, but <sighs> it's not satire when you have a nice quality. We can see your teeth. What? You can't see my teeth. What? What? It's about my teeth. What? What is he? Why? What? It's not satire when you have a nice quality. We can see your teeth. When you have a nice quality, we can see your teeth. 
It's not satire when it... Am I stupid? You can't see my teeth. High resolution teeth watching? Teeth? It's not satire when you have a nice quality, we can see your teeth. But we can't. You can't see my teeth. They're fake. <laughs> They're not my teeth. They're fake. They're fake teeth. <laughs> what do you mean? They don't really exist. Yeah, you I, only have six I, left. I don't understand. They're not my teeth. Yeah, it, that that's not even what's happening. So, and, and I think that's what makes content like what I do. This is what I've always liked to do is like, I've always liked to blur the line between like what's real and what's not. Because I think that it's entertaining. It's more and entertaining, it's interesting. yeah. And I remember... I, I think that you know where I originally got the idea of like why I thought this was so entertaining was from Athene. Because Athene, like, he would do so many ridiculous things, but at the same time, it would be counterbalanced by him actually being ridiculous in like real ways. Oh. And I love that dichotomy. I thought it was so compelling and interesting. I guess they tried to the give games, a compliment. Yeah, like eating Maybe. the broccoli like while you're taking a, a shit or something like that, right? <laughs> it, it's just like, what? Is the teeth thing fake too? No, it's not. No, that that, that is true. Yourself. Many YouTubers do it. Yeah. He actually is and missing so teeth. I, I love doing this kind of he stuff. He doesn't have back teeth. Entertainment. Yeah. And I think, yeah, I, I love literally entertaining make people. Cult? I think that sure it's so funny. That. I, I I really oh do, and was the rat in your kitchen real? Yeah, yes. I, t I made a, a picture of it. <laughs> yeah, I, I I do, and and AI generated, I, I, AI generated. I, I, I think it's so fun. Exaggerating parts of your personality. Some people are so obvious. Yeah, and and I I do it sometimes, right? But I feel like again, I I think I make it kind of obvious. I think so too. But maybe not. Nah, people are just stupid. Washing I just put up water down with soda. I didn't see this at all. <laughs> the A1 bottles. He what needs a full steak. Yeah, like let him have a full steak. Wow. Oh my... You want him to always go back into the fucking kitchen for it? Like, bro. If it doesn't need to be fridged, <laughs> what's the issue? <laughs> Let's say one of the some steak sauce or something from America. Just, I don't yes. exactly know. Never had Bro it. Bro drinks A1. It's delicious. He doesn't drink it! It's for his steaks! Bro, it's for his two dollar steaks. People think Esmond is not human. He's a goblin. I mean, he's the goblin king. I never thought I saw this before. And do you know what's really funny about this? It's a slip. Is that... <laughs> yeah, bye! I really, um... I really want you guys to understand this, that this isn't even my final form. And <laughs> if you look at my old videos... That like, was so much worse. Bro, you used to be way worse. So this is just like one video, right? <gasps> it opens with ants being all over... Um, all over my, uh, my ceiling here. Oh my god. Uh, and then the next clip is, like, drinks everywhere of playing World of Warcraft. And then the next clip is me, uh... How sad it used to be so much worse. I, I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm just, like, eating something, I guess. <laughs> and then, oh, I have marshmallow paste. Is that the underworld? It's the same room. And same I'm eating room. it out of here with my fingers. Without yeah, washing yeah, yeah, yeah. my hands. <laughs> so disgusting. Yeah, and, and then, you know, you fast forward a little bit longer. <laughs> that is so disgusting. And it's disgusting. like I'm playing video games. And now I they didn't give me a straw at Jack in the Box. So I have Look to the repurpose an old straw from Jack in the Box into a oh, new drink from Jack in the Box. And there's another computer on the ground. There's just garbage and beer. This is like a, there's, like, this is just... Man cave. And, and then at the end that of it... That is your average um, goon cave right there. Like... Thanks for the following, Jaggins. Whatever, they're the same thing. No, they're not. 
know what? Emo kids cut themselves. Seen kids dress up like Christmas trees. Is there a black and white? And I, I, like, I'm sitting here talking about, like, how emo kids are killing themselves, listening to Breathe Carolina. I haven't showered in months. <laughs> this is from 2011, from July 11th, 2011. And horse teeth, yeah, exactly. And... Oh, yeah, and he used to, like, smear the blood from his mouth onto the fucking wall. Don't forget about that. It's this still there. Only... It's not cleaned up. It's just dried blood on the this fucking is, wall. This is, like, one day. That's what I want you guys to understand. It's not like this... Why? This only yeah. happened this one day. Can't tell you. And then after this day was over... He, I... He's just a disgusting human being. There's nothing more to it. No deeper meaning. He's just... Disgusting. Yeah, he's entertaining. <laughs> he's much better now, though. He is definitely in a better place. I just, like, kind of went back to the rest of my life. No, this was, like, normal. Esma was what Maxim before it was a thing. Literally. And... I have... I'm not even kidding you guys. Over a hundred hours of oh. content... That's probably as bad, if not worse, than this. I need to take meds. I need to take happy pills. I remember we took a video camera to high school, and we recorded ourselves on the bus. Okay. And I would wear this hat, and it was like a hat that had, like, it was like Donald Dunk or a chicken on it. And I would stick my head out the uh, out of the hole in the bus window, and I would call people the f word and scream what? at them while we recorded it on the bus in like 2006. <laughs> and then we would throw rocks. At <laughs> Bro, dumbest teens, man. Bro. And we'd be listening to Kanye West. That room made me feel sick. Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't want to live in a room like this either. He was too much into Warcraft, so he became the Lich King. He literally is the Lich King. Like, whenever he's live, he gathers all the gooners and all the goblins around so they don't go distract other streamers like Emiru. <laughs> and I remember recording this at the time and thinking to myself... <laughs> I have to record this because if I don't, nobody will believe that it ever happened. <laughs> That's true. Because even then, I knew it was so ridiculous. This is how are we? How are we getting away with this? Yeah. Like, how is this happening? Like literally, how? Top how? tier content. Yes. <laughs> and this is just like, by the way, this is just from 2006. There's stuff from 2004. To, stuff from 2002, 2009, 2015. Like. I don't think people realize how deep this rabbit hole goes. <laughs> they have no idea. I have watched the um, the story, like the videos, like the, those long ass documentary kind of video that he has on his channel about the true story about him, you know, like about his WoW Classic, about the TPC and did he have a world of like a Lich King one too? I think so. Mm -hmm. I think so? It's just been forever since I've seen him. Maybe I should rewatch it. Freshen up on that uh, Asman lore. I thought I was bad in my college years. I was wrong. Yeah. Yeah. Since age 12? Age 11. I was 11 years old when I got my first video camera. And before then, I had a camera that could record video, but it wasn't very good. And then we used my friend's video camera that recorded directly to a VHS tape. So I'd have to, like, get some of those. Like, we really started at nine years old. Dumb. And, um... Menace all along, what do you call man. Freaking menace. Like, yeah, at, at... Yeah, we started at nine years old. So this is, like, 2009. Maybe eight years old. We were <laughs> making videos and making content. And then... That, at, like, 11, that's whenever we really, really started... Uh, we really started putting in work. Yeah, 1999. No, it was 1999, 1998. And then I got a, a wow. video camera in the, the Christmas of 2001. Jesus, man. Esmond is 34. 
Yeah. So, yeah, I, I just, you're 43, shut up. And <laughs> he's 55. How bad did you get bullied? There was one time that a kid bullied me in middle school and I stabbed him with a fork and I broke the fork, uh, like things out inside of his skin. New Esmond law dropped. What the fuck? And that was it. Bro. And then another time a kid. I mean, to be fair, to be fair, he didn't get bullied afterwards anymore. He bullied me when we were playing baseball and then I, I, he was pitching to me and I hit the ball and I broke out one of his teeth. I mean, did they have a coming? I mean, they trying to bully someone. They and just, I remember walking up to him, just he was bleeding and crying, and I was like laughing. And <laughs> everybody else was like, what's wrong with you? And I said, this is the best day of my life. Ah! Oh my god. Actual menace. <laughs> and like nobody thought that I did it on purpose. So, like there I did this is an accident, right? Like, yeah, this is this is great. It's bad luck, yeah. And so I never had I never got bullied by anybody. Never. Um I, I never like people would maybe joke around with me, right? Or I mean like, you know, people would call me, you know, the F word, right? I mean, but like this was two thousand and five. Everybody did that. Um, the like, Fred, people, like, we, we'd make word. fun of each other, but, like, this wasn't friend. I mean, it, it, it might yep. as well have been, right? <laughs> I mean, like, we'd make fun of each other, like, oh, yeah, you look like a dusty old loser-ass bitch. Like, yeah, for sure, right? And, and like, this, it's funny. And, like, oh, your mom is so fat. And, like, my mom was fat. And so it was like, yeah, yeah, yeah right. So, and, yeah, like, and, and so this what? is just the way like, it was. Okay, and, yeah, and, and, what yeah, else is but, new? Like, that's just the that, this that's banter yeah it's guys but like did i get actually like bullied right like bullied in school like n absolutely not no no I nobody think this nobody was normal for children teams absolutely of that not. era i remember it well for texas it's normal yeah i no. guess um i i yeah i i'm trying to think like if if anybody ever would you bully other people i'm trying to think that if i bullied anybody else really why does it seem not like Asmund's kind of bragging about it? I'm not the only one getting this feeling right. I mean... Bragging about what exactly, you know? Like, what do you, what do you mean? Like, yeah, he's talking about his past, about how he's just, like, a stupid degen of a human being. Yeah. Of course. Yeah, he's bragging about being a fucking degen. It's his lore. Yeah. Any more than just, like saying a comment uh like not like a uh like an ongoing thing where i would bully somebody no it would still be normal if not for the extreme karens and the perpetually offended honestly i feel like people get too offended by words nowadays i feel like people in a sense choose to be overly offended like people are giving words power that that's my opinion on it like, okay, so it did have, maybe the word did have history, but you, you are up keeping the history of the word instead of just letting the word be, become meaningless, you know? The more someone uses a word, the more someone gets used to something, the less, uh, like, the m less meaning it has. That's just how nature works. That's just how it is. I'm people choosing to get offended ab about any fucking word ever? Like, see yourself out, man. Fucking see yourself out. Yeah, there, there's more important things to get um, upset about, man. Uh, you threw rocks at people? Yeah, but we weren't really bull- Like, we didn't even- we didn't even know who they were. Yeah, like, I mean, it, it's not like we really- like, these my are random people. My brothers did that. My brothers like, did that. My, my mom we're was mad at them, them but my brothers like did them. it anyway. Like, we're just doing it for fun. Yeah, um, I, I'm trying to think, like, yeah, that's assault, not bullying? Yeah, yeah, uh, but well, what, whatever, it was fun. And, uh, you bully me, Drogear? I do bully Drogear, true. Normally, if you weren't bullied, you were the bully? No, nobody in my school ever got bullied. Because I remember there was one time that me and my friend 
we called another kid fat and mm -hmm. then he talked to a, a person and like i guess like he thought that we were bullying him and the administrator came over to us and they were like you can't go around and talk to people like that like i know you guys do that with your friends but he doesn't like that so if you do it again you're getting expelled and that was that and we were like oh okay and that was that and that was it yeah there that it was it and we're like oh shit my bad yeah wow wow okay fuck we we messed up base principal no it wasn't even a principal it was just like a like <coughs> like this just shows that oh my god like i'm just that's just teacher on. Yeah, same thing at my school, too. No, like, you you were not allowed to bully anybody. P pussy school? No, it was the opposite. Uh, somebody got killed at my school. What? And so, like, we had a police station on campus. We had, like, uh, one of the, the guards there was, like, a federal prison security guard. Um, guy looked like a ninja go. turtle. Have a good um, birthday. Thank you. Like, Thanks it was for hanging really, out. really no fights. Zero fights. Literally zero fights. If you touch somebody else, you were out of school instantaneous so yeah like, were, i don't were know even, this like, kids that were like uh like neo there was like this one kid there was like a neo-nazi just wanted to stop by and also tell you happy birthday oh sorry chat is going back too fast it's also my birthday as well well happy birthday to you too thank you and he would always, you know, he had like the swastika on his bag and it was like everything. Everybody well, called him the F word. On YouTube. And Enjoy. people were like, oh, it's this loser. But nobody ever beat him up. Because if you did, you'd get expelled. Yeah, PV PvP mode was completely off. <laughs> I saw one time this guy th told no me that PvP, he was going to get man. in a fight after the class. And he grabbed another kid and the federal prison security guard, I remember grabbed this kid. This kid was like 180 pounds. He's like six feet tall. Grabbed Jesus. him with one hand by his shirt. I could hear the shirt tear. Oh my as God. As the officer took him in one arm and threw him against the lockers. Oh my. Slammed against lockers and then put his knee on the back of this kid's neck in like 0.3 seconds. What? What the fuck? And I was just like, "Well, damn." Yeah, you know, because like he had been talking up, right? The yeah, whole, you know the what? Let's be. He's gonna beat the fuck out of this kid. Everything like this, right? I'm like, great. You know, this is gonna be awesome. We're gonna watch this. But yeah, yeah, no, there was <laughs> easy takedown. Yeah, I got expelled for throwing an orange thirty yards in our girl's face. Yeah, yeah. No, like there, we had no tolerance for that stuff at all. No, I never got bullied. Any of that stuff ever happened. But I just want you guys to know that, like, for all of the bad stuff that you've seen about me on the internet and, like, all of the bad videos, you've seen less than 10% of the true footage and my final <laughs> form. So however bad you think that any of this is or anything else, this is less than 10% of it. And if you ask any of my long-term real-life friends, they'll, they'll confirm this. They will all confirm this. Yeah, this is the tip of the iceberg. Back in my school, they really, they organized gang fights between schools and they had 40 people show up. Yeah, we had that happen. Mm -hmm. There was like a park that people would do that at. And then they just started, um, there was like a fight club at the park because people kept putting uh, videos of it on MySpace. A fight and, club. Uh, okay. okay. And it was great, right? <laughs> Of course it was great. Oh, my like, God. They, they shut that down really fast. <laughs> they did. Yeah, the ghetto park. Yeah, yeah. We had the fight night. Yeah, we had that, too. And, and, and yeah, then there were, like, police officers there every single time. That was, that was the end of it. Oh, my God.